Hey folks, how's it going? I've got the second part of my PSA Ultra Modern submission to share with you today. I'm gonna have a lot of cool football and basketball cards in this one. Need everybody to do me a real quick favor though, make sure you go ahead and like the video and subscribe to see more openings. I'm gonna have the next part of this submission coming out in a few days. And while you're at it, make sure you go ahead and catch the first part. Had a lot of cool rookies in that one too. But I waited about a calendar year to get this submission back. If you're wondering what the exact dates were on this submission, this is what we're looking at here. Um, yeah, it was a full calendar year, but luckily this one was worth the wait. If you're still waiting to hear back from PSA and get your submission back, I hope this helps out and you get nothing but 10s. But we'll go ahead and get started uh, with some Chronicles. Uh, had some of the... XRs, uh, we had a bronze ion. We got a nine on that one. Then we had a pink nine as well. Had a teal John Morant. We got a nine on that. Then we had some base as well. Uh, had a nine on the first jaw. Nine on the second. Nine on the third. And then a nine on the fourth. Kind of rough on that, nothing but nines, but I would say this stack definitely made up for it. Uh, we had a 10 on the silver Zion. Then we had some base too, uh, had a 10 on the first and a 10 on the second. Set in some Lucas as well. We had a 10 on the first one, 10 on the second, and then we had an RJ Barrett as well. We got a 10 on that too. Had some Chronicles football as well. Uh, we had the Optic Preview Red Joe Burrow. We got a nine on this. Got a nine on the Limited Phenoms Justin Herbert. And then a 10 on the Certified Herbert. About the same time Chronicles came out, uh, Lucians came out as well. Uh, had some base for this. Uh, had a nine on the Zion. Another nine on the Zion. Got a nine on the John Morant. Got a 10 on one of the trophy collections. And then a nine on the other one. So probably the coolest part of this submission is Mosaic came out, I think it was shortly before Chronicles uh, Basketball did. And yeah, this part of the order is awesome. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get started with some of the base. Uh, had a 10 on the Herbert. Another 10 Herbert. And then a uh, Jordan Love 10. Going to jump into some of the parallels now. Uh, had a 9 on the Clyde Edwards Alaire. That's going to be the green. And probably the coolest card in the order. It's going to be the Keyshawn Vaughn 10 Genesis. Uh, Genesis is probably the coolest parallel in Mosaic. Uh, definitely the most collected and sought after. Uh, I know it's just Keyshawn Vaughn, but I think anybody who was in really good shape, I would have sent in for grading because these are awesome. So I ended up buying a lot of Mosaic uh, in one player in particular, and that is going to be a lot of Jalen Hurts. I thought he had a chance to... Uh, start for the Eagles, and that ended up being right. Uh, but yeah, you'll have to let me know if you think Jalen Hurts is going to be the Eagles quarterback of the future. But we had the reactive orange. We got a 10 on that one. 10 on the reactive green. Another 10 on the reactive green. The red mosaic, we got a 10 on that. 9 on the red mosaic. And then one more 10 mosaic. Another really cool parallel out of mosaic, and I wish they had a better name for it. It's going to be the mosaic mosaics. Uh, these are all going to be Jalen Hurts as well. We had a 10 on the first one. I think this whole stack is 10s. Uh, 10 on the second. 10 on the third. 10 on the fourth. 10 on the fifth. And you betcha, yeah, that was six for six on those. 
And then I've got one more stack of Jalen Hurts. Uh, it is going to be the team colors there. Uh, the green mosaic looked really cool with the uh, Eagles jerseys. So had, I believe it's 11 of these, and they were all going to be 10s. I still can't believe uh, I did as well as I did on this part of the submission. Um, yeah, Mosaic Football, uh, really cool product, but I know there were a lot of printing issues for it. Uh, saw some bad surface in shoes, some indents, uh, some like rough corners on some of their stuff. But to have everything come back aside from two cards as tens, I really can't believe it. This was such a cool surprise in the submission. But folks, that is everything I got for you today. Like I said, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to make sure you catch the third part. Really do appreciate the support. And while you're at it, make sure you go ahead and watch the first part if you haven't already. But folks, I hope you have a great rest of your day.